we're talking about the algebra of real functions and we just learned the addition of real function now we are going to talk about the subtraction of real functions two or more than two real functions okay so uh, the condition is again the same just like in the addition of two real functions uh, let's say uh, we have a function f which is defined from x to r where x is uh, some real functions a subset of uh, r real number you can say similarly g is another function which is defined from x to r all right where x is again uh, i mean the same you know uh, some subset of real number then in this condition again in the same condition we're going to now find out the difference of these two function f and g okay so difference of the function f and g we can define from x to uh, some real numbers by uh, let's say f minus g of x x is a member of uh, this x okay uh, equals to f of x minus g of x where x is the member of uh, x okay so uh, let's take example that will be more better uh, let's say f of x we have 3x square and g of x let's say we have uh, 5x so that time f minus g of x will be equals to f of x minus g of x and that's here you can see f of x is 3x squared so I can write here 3x squared and g of x is 5x so I can write 5x so uh, f minus g f minus g of x or you can say the difference of the two function f and g is equals to 3x squared minus 5x uh, let's say for a while uh, x is containing one element let's say 1 2 whatever it is you know so let's say for a while x equals to 2 okay so in this case uh, f minus g of 2 will be 3 times 2 square minus 5 times 2 all right so it's 3 times 4 uh, 2 square is 4 all right minus 10 and then it's going to be 12 minus 10 that's 2 and that's our answer so this is how we have to find out the subtraction of the two function or more than two functions uh, I hope you understand if there is any more confusion you can definitely uh, comment below I will definitely apply your comment and uh, now the third algebra of uh, uh, two real functions or more than two real functions we will learn that's product of real functions.